Dear Kamala Harris, let's get one thing crystal clear. The vast majority of American men have no issue with electing a female president. Our issue lies solely with you. You were second in charge of California for 13 years. As California's Attorney General, Harris promoted enforcement of a law that allowed prosecutors to seek jail time for parents of truant kids. As a prosecutor in law enforcement, I have a huge stick. So I decided I was going to start prosecuting parents for truancy. I thought that was crazy. I, I was like, how can you lock parents up? If you don't go to school, Kamala's going to put you and me in jail. Yes, we achieved intend intended effect. I open the door and I see at least seven or eight cops that wanted to arrest me. As a matter of fact, they did. And frankly, you know the prosecutors in my office who volunteered to do this? My homicide prosecutors, my gang prosecutors. And they went over there and I said, when you go over there, look really mean. She had me arrested and prosecuted because my handicapped daughter was sick in the hospital and had missed some days of school. I learned that with the swipe of my pen, I could charge someone with the lowest level offense. That person could be arrested, they could lose time from work and their family maybe lose their job. They'd have to come out of their own pocket to help hire a lawyer. They'd lose standing in their community. I lost my job and couldn't pay rent, and we got evicted. Weeks later, I could dismiss the charges, but their life would forever be changed. I became homeless. We had to move into a motel. All because of the swipe of my pen. I don't agree what Kamala Harris did to my mom. And I don't, I don't agree with what she's done to other parents as well. You were second in charge of the United States for four years. If anything, would you have done something differently than President Biden during the past four years? Uh, there is not a thing that comes to mind in terms of, and I've been a part of, of, of most of the decisions that have had impact. Inflation is hitting the highest level in 39 years. A record high number of illegal crossings. Crime's been surging across the nation. Huge spikes in homicides. Could we be heading toward World War III? After 17 years of failed leadership, you are now asking us to trust you as first in charge of our country. I am concerned and focused on big issues. Elementary and middle school truancy is actually a big issue if we're trying to save the state money. Because of truancy, California public schools lose $1.4 billion a year in funding. I want money. <laughs> <laughs> My message to all Americans, do not trust Kamala Harris. As men and protectors of women and children, you are simply a risk we are not willing to take. Paid for by Maha Alliance and not authorized by any candidate or candidate's committee.